It's a case of mom versus principal. In tonight's Houston, I have a problem. Stephanie Voles called us after she claims the principal kicked her off the campus. Mm. District officials say school leaders were within their rights in response to what they describe as her use of profanity in front of students. Anchor Ryan Houston joins us with both sides of this story. Tempers flared. I said this shit is crazy. <laughs> That's all? That's it. Stephanie Bowl says that four letter word got her banned from district property in Hamilton City Schools. I pressed her on what else she said to the principal of Riverview Elementary. I didn't threaten anybody. I had five kids with me, so I had a kid in a stroller. The single mom of three claims this started all because of how she wanted to pick her kids up from school. I walked them there in the morning and drop them off and I walked back that way and they don't have a problem with it. But after school, they feel that there's a problem. Well, I didn't get any dismissal letters. I didn't, there's no signs posted saying that we can't walk there. The school disagrees. In the letter banning her from school property without prior approval, Superintendent Mike Holbrook states she was using the walkway in the bus pickup lot and her children were told repeatedly in the first two weeks of school not to do it and she told them to do it anyway. Vols told me this is affecting her kids. She says as a single mom, she needs to be able to go to school for parent-teacher conferences, awards assemblies, and just any other school activity. I can't take them to none of that, and I'm their only parent that's in their life that is able to take them. Vols contacted Nine on Your Side after she claimed no one at the school would talk to her. Well, I called Hamilton City School Board member Tom Alf. He told me to tell Ms. Voles to call the superintendent's office and ask to be put on the agenda to make her case in front of the entire school board. I want to sit down and have a meeting with them. I want to apologize for my actions for that day, and I would like them to apologize for theirs. School spokesperson Joni Copa sent over this statement. It reads in part, This superintendent or building principal has the authority to prohibit the entry of any person to a school of this district or to expel any person when there is reason to believe the presence of such person would be detrimental to the good order of the school. We'll call this one partially solved. Stephanie Voles is set to address the school board on September 24th. And as always, if you have a problem and need some help, send an email to Houston at WCPL.com or you can leave a message at 513-852-1360. For Houston, I have a problem.